All right, today we're going to show a product called Heat Shield. And what this is good for, it's good for, it's a protective barrier for soldering welding applications. You know, a lot of people use this when they're working on tractor trailers, trailers themselves. They, they get up underneath a dashboard and they don't want to catch anything else on fire, but they got to do some soldering on wires or RVs where they got the wires running through the side. What we don't want to do is burn other things and save time and save money by being able to work on it in place. What I'm going to show you today is how heat shield actually works. And by doing this, this is the same product that you'll see on TV where people light themselves on fire and they have it sprayed on their arms. And then they walk around and they put it out. I do not suggest you spray this on anybody's arms or anybody. This is a normal styrofoam cup that I'm going to be demonstrating. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the product called Heat Shield. Now this is a gel and it comes in a quart bottle such, just like this. I'm going to spray this on the styrofoam cup on the front half of where I'm holding it, as you can see. Alright, to show you that this is a normal styrofoam cup, I'll, spray, I'll burn the other half. You can see how fast it went through. Show you one more time. This is the side with heat shield on it. Normal styrofoam cup with heat shield. Then spray down up here. You can see how it goes through. The unique thing about heat shield, after you, which wipes off clean, and you get it all off of there, it leaves no residue. Will not stain and will not, uh, it, it just, it's a great product for keeping things from burning and will not stain other products like carpets or upholstery.